Okay, so this is probably more of a video for myself than anything, but I've been trying for hours to get my Google Home, my Philips Hue lights, my LifeX lights, and all sorts of lights, and duplicate, um, duplicate lights, duplicate speakers, ghost speakers, just things I can't delete off the Google Home app. And no matter how many times I go on support, it's just not much help. And then or they're always like, oh, no an issue, no an issue. So having worked in IT and still working in IT, I figured, why not I just fix it myself? And I did. Um, so long story short, the problem that I found is um, multiple accounts causes this, what I found um, is that older accounts that you may have put to be experimenting with stuff um, may still be holding some of those speaker informations and so what you do is you go into the app and you um, click on the settings button as of the recording of today that's still there um, just click on settings which is from the main page settings and then you go delete home Basically, you do this for every one of your accounts. Yes, whatever you've done, just forget about it. It's not worth the effort. Delete everything. Delete everything. Remove, um, delete your accounts for, uh, uh, remove the homes uh, for each of the individual accounts that you want to keep. So say you have four people in your family, you, your wife, and your two kids. Delete them all from each of their accounts from the home. Um, and then what you do is you remove all the lights from Philips Hue and LifeX and whatnot, um, and basically just start again as if you got it straight from the shop. And then we re-add the lights first, add all the lights, like set them all up, make sure they work, and then um, uninstall your Google Home app, reinstall it, and then you go in, you create a new Gmail account, a completely new account, um, fresh, set up a new home. Uh, in fact, you don't even have to set up a new home, just normal home. Um, and add all the lights, add all the speakers individually. And then um, once you've done that, uh, it actually shows up. It showed up for me, so there were no problems and I had no issues adding them, no ghost speakers or anything. Um, then you, instead of re-adding every one of them, you invite each new, each existing member back into the home. So I would, in using this administrator account or, or template account, you invite yourself and then so it'll copy all this data and then you invite your partner, you invite your two kids or whoever is in your house and they can retrain all their voices um, if they want. Uh, as of this recording, all the retraining, all the retrainings are all, all stopped up and they don't work. So if you're lucky like me, both my wife and I had the voices already done on the old accounts and so it just copied them across but for our kids none of them were working for some reason and if you go okay and then google um to do the retraining sometimes it won't do anything sometimes it'll tick 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 and and then it'll just pause anyway i haven't tried i haven't solved that one yet but uh hopefully google can fix that with the next patch but yeah so that's how you fix all of it. Anyway, like I said, this is more of a video for myself because I can't be bothered writing all this down and spent hours and hours and hours trying to figure it out. And now all my lights are working again. Hey, Google, lights on. OK, turning on six lights. <sighs> six lights, not 11 lights. <sighs>